Hello friends. So in this video, we'll cover the topic capital budgeting. So this data is being provided in the question. I'll read out the question first. ABC Limited is in the process of selecting a capital project. The details of two capital projects A and B are given below. You are required to first evaluate the above capital budgeting projects and recommend the project to be implemented so that the company earns maximum profit on the basis of IRR method and NPV method. And also we have to calculate the value of NPV of project A at the rate of interest 10% to 15%. So the question has been divided into two parts. Uh, in the first part, we have to calculate NPV and IRR for both the projects. And then we have to choose, uh, the company will choose which project for their NPV and IR. So remember, the greater the NPV, the better for the company. The greater the IR, the better for the company. Same apply, like if NPV of A is greater, then a project A will be chooses or else B. And in the second part of the question, we have to calculate NPV of project A, a at the rate of 10 to 15%. So this table uh, will solve part two of this question. So let's start. First, we have to calculate NPV of project A. So the function for this is, is equals to NPV, open brackets, rate, then cash flow inflow, cash flows inflow key values. We'll select this to year five and bracket closed. And then we have to add the cost of project in this, enter. Same with project B is equals to NPV, open brackets, rate, comma, cash inflows. Bracket closed plus cost of project is equals to. Now we'll calculate IRR. The function for this is, is equals to IRR, open brackets, and then we'll select cost of project and cash inflows. Bracket closed. Same with this is equals to IRR open brackets cost of project is equals to IRR Now we have to give this decision ki whether the company will choose A or B. So for this, we'll apply a function that if the NPV of project A is greater than B, then we'll choose project A or else B. Same with IR, if the IRR of project A is greater than B, then we'll choose A or else B. Now see how we'll implement this in function is equals to if open brackets. Now NPV of A, if greater than NPV of B, then we'll choose project A or else we'll choose project B. Okay, bracket closed. See, NPV of A is greater than function implies project A. Same for the IRR. If IRR of project A, if IRR of project A is greater than project B, then we'll choose project A or else project B, get closed, enter. Okay, the first part of this question is done. Now we have to calculate NPV at the rate of 10 to 15 percent for project A. So same is equals to NPV open brackets. Now rate rate will differ so we'll not fix this value then we'll have to select the cash inflows for the year one to five as it's gonna be fixed so we'll fix this value bracket closed plus cost of project we'll fix this also because it will not change in the whole table so we get now drag the cursor till Okay, now this is all in the capital budgeting. It's one of the simplest topic. What we have to calculate is NPV plus IRR. And if they, uh, they, uh, we have asked to calculate decision, like for which project uh, company will choose, then we'll apply, apply a function. 
and in this question we have to ask to calculate uh, NPV of project 8 at different rates then we will calculate this also okay bye bye tada thank you